All right, guys, it's seven o'clock, so we're going to go ahead and get started. I am Shantae with Completely Crafty by Shantae, and I just want to welcome you to my page. I have my girlfriend Susan with me tonight. Hey, everyone. And we, I know you're probably thinking, why does she have that Santa hat on her head? <laughs> well, hey, Nina. Well, it's Christmas in July, so we are going to be doing a couple of Christmas wreaths this month. I may only do two, but we'll see how that goes. Um, but we'll start off today. I want to show you what I made earlier. So I made this mini Love it. Um, Noel wreath. Merry Christmas, Aunt Donna. <laughs> so I made <laughs> this um, with um, some red mesh, which is so soft. Like most times, like this mesh over here, it's a little know the, the fabric but it scratches and it messes up the nails um, but this is really really soft and I paired it with um, burlap ribbon and I found this at the end of the season last year at Walmart um, this Noel ribbon which is only one inch which I've never really used before and I thought I'll try something different um, and I think it turned out pretty nice very nice. So I thought I would duplicate that by making one. This one says joy. So I asked my hubby to um, help me pick out uh, on the ribbon. And so this is what he chose. <laughs> so if you don't like it, it's his fault. But if you do, it's mine. <laughs> so I have, oops, I have this green ribbon with um, red trim and then this is um, red on khaki we'll check so what I'm going to do is very nice probably pair it and put the since the green is so dominant and it's on this red backing I'll put this layer this on top so we are going to be working I'm going to move some stuff around we're going to be working with our mini wreath. It's an eight each um, eight inch ring. You want to confirm that? Yes. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to put three of the pipe cleaners. <laughs> right. Um, three on each of the um, sections here. So let's go ahead and get that done. So what I'll do is I'll put two pop cleaners on the bottom and one on the top. Susan and I just heard some rumbling. We didn't know if it was thunder or if it was Romeo, our dog, uh, upstairs. So I thought, I thought it was thunder. <laughs> hopefully it's well, hopefully it's Romeo because we don't want the power to go out. Right. <laughs> but hopefully it's thunder because if not, Rome is loud. <laughs> he can be loud. <laughs> He's sweet. He didn't want to hang out with us tonight, so he went upstairs. He's mad at me for missing last week. Right. <laughs> <laughs> Payback. <laughs> So did everyone have a good day? How's the, how are you holding up in this weather? <laughs> Trent said it was hotter. He felt like it was hotter today than it was yesterday, but I don't know, because it was 98 degrees yesterday. This whole It was just, was, it was just awful. And my poor good. plants, even though I watered them, they are all dead. Oh no. Well, I won't say all dead, but majority of them are dead. They'll come back. All right, so. I've done if you can see that I've done um, technically from this vantage point there's two at the top and one at the bottom but when it's laid flat it's just the opposite and what I've done is I've cut um, the mesh in 10 inch cuts and then I um I think two four six eight ten twelve at 10 inch and then I cut three at 20 inch because what I'm going to do oh hot 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 92 degrees in Jersey 
So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to roll two of the uh, 10 inch mesh and put them in each tie. So not too big, not too small, not tight, you know. They're calling for rain tomorrow, so hopefully it cools it off and not make it more muggy. And what you want to do is just crisscross them. And you don't you want to see make sure that the opening is at the bottom so that it doesn't um, it looks more finished. And then I'm just going to click it up a little bit. And I'll do that all around the bottom. And with every um, piece of mesh, there is some fraying. So the less you touch it, the better. And if you see some loose ends, you want to clip those off so that it doesn't continue to fray. But again, the more you touch it, the more it will fray. sure I pre-cut everything so it may be next week depending on what I make I won't I'll show you that step too but I just didn't want to keep you long Susan didn't make it last week because she was editing her photos that she had from her photo shoot to a lavender field. A, they were actually on a lavender farm, right? Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. um, where was it? Williamsburg. Williamsburg. Oh, that's right, Williamsburg, mm -hmm. um, Virginia. Yes. So she showed me just one of the pictures, and it's so pretty. And the couple's pretty, too. I just got to get you down to Richmond so I can get a picture of you in front of that mickey oh my goodness yes facade of the, the one of the murals down there the facade of a building my husband was teasing he's like don't you want to go to disney world and i was like uh yes <laughs> <laughs> that is a tease he was like but you don't even ride i was like it's not about the rides it's about the guy <laughs> oh <laughs> i don't care about the rides there's something for everybody there. there is he thought universal would be better and i was like i definitely wouldn't do that that, that would not interest me. You still gotta check out Hershey if you haven't been there. Just Hershey get, Park? Yeah. Oh, we, just, we used to go when oh, that's we... Oh, you've uh, been there. Okay. I'm from Pennsylvania. <laughs> <laughs> we used to go to church all the time. <laughs> I'm a senior moment over here. <laughs> that's right. That's I, it's, but it's been a while. I haven't been, you know... Uh, well, they have added a lot, so... Oh, for sure. I'm trying to think. I probably haven't been since Jeremy was little, and I don't even know if I went when he went. Aww. So. All right, so we are almost finished on the bottom. And again, I'm loving how soft it is. It just looks soft. Mm. <laughs> Nina said um, they love Universal. She has to agree with Trent. <laughs> okay, well, then you can go with Trent. <laughs> I'm going to Disney. All right, so here's the bottom. And then what I'm going to do, I have these cut at 20 inch, and I'm just going to do a sloppy um, curl. I don't want to make it too tight, but I just want to make sure that the edges, and so I just curl it up a little bit. We're still trying to figure out how we're going to celebrate our anniversary, which is coming up in October, oh. um, because uh, I have I do have a craft show in October um, and a possibility for another one. And then um, the crafting group I'm in, um, they're doing a wreath uh, a wreath retreat the very weekend of our anniversary. I was like. Oh. Do that. And but but that's closer and it's in um it's in Charlotte. You can celebrate. 
is on another day. Oh, for sure. But I mean, I can't afford to take that trip I, and then to us take another uh, trip. <laughs> that makes sense. Somewhere else. Cost involved, right? Right, because I, I promised we would go to Vegas so that he mm. could find. I bought him the. Um, he's a Raider fan, and I bought him a block with his name on it at the stadium, so he wants to, to find his block. So. I've never been. That sounds like a fun, fun trip. I've only been once. I had a good time. Awesome. All right, this is our last curl. It's looking very pretty already. This one, I didn't. This one is a little bit longer than twenty inches because this was the last of the roll, and I, I don't like to be wasteful, so I just used it all. So and although it's a small wreath, it's still very full. It is, it looks very nice. All right. Another thing about mesh, it likes to stick to everything and itself, so it gets a little funky. All right, so I have that ready. So what I'm gonna do, see, look, look at that. I don't wanna pull it, so I'm just gonna clip it. And I am going to, what I did with these, these are cut at 12 inches and I used my Perfect Tails, which I love. You know what, and I did 12, oh no, I did good. In my head I was thinking I probably should have done a small one, but 12 is it. <laughs> and so I'm just gonna, um, and I ducktail the ends, just a little V, just to make it um, look complete. And I'm just going to fold that in half. I love the ribbon selection. Great. I think it's very, very nice. I would like to visit the castle and stay in the safari. Oh, yes. I would love to stay at the safari hotel, too. That would be nice. We always stay at, the first time we went, we went to the all-star one with the sports, because I'm all about, I love me some sports. But then... Every time we went back, we went. We stayed in the Port of Orleans, I believe it was, because it looks like Louisiana. Um, oh, me, me, me. Louisiana. Okay. New Orleans. <laughs> Why I was getting that? All right. So, because I'm using pipe cleaners, it doesn't look as finished um, as the regular work form. So I'm just going to clip that off, and then I'm going to tuck the remaining behind, and then I'm going to just spread out the tails We're also planning to visit Arizona and our, the couple we met on our honeymoon um, from Florida was going to try to meet us in Arizona so we can visit our other friend in Arizona who just had the baby. Um, That's special. But we're just trying to coordinate schedules because October probably would work, actually probably works better for us and um, the Florida couple because starting November it's basketball season for Trent. Busy, so busy, I won't busy. see him. <laughs> I won't see him until spring. <laughs> but maybe you could take me and show me around the Philly Christmas Village. I've always wanted to go see that. Okay. We have our little girls trip. Well, to Nina, <laughs> we want to go um, see the Philly um, Christmas Village. Because Nina is still in Philly. I see it on Instagram. And I, <laughs> I, I, I've told Paul, I said, I really want to go. And uh, if he doesn't want to go, he doesn't remember. So <laughs> I'm, the only one, I'm the only one interested. <laughs> oh, no. It looks like it'd be beautiful, though. It's just, um, it just... You know, during the holidays, just getting a hotel room is so expensive. Oh, so that's yeah. the 
you know. I mean, technically it could be a day trip, but it would be exhausting. Yes, it would be exhausting. <laughs> I've done that. <laughs> and it's not fun. Nina says, sounds good to me. All right, we'll have to figure something out. So, Trent's birthday weekend, his birthday is July 23rd, but of course he has basketball, so I don't feel guilty about this, but on the 24th, I have a craft show, <laughs> so Aww. he will sp be spending his birthday weekend at a craft show with me. <laughs> uh, I was... And he'll like it. <laughs> <laughs> exactly. Uh, when we were at the last craft show, uh, a father and daughter came. They're uh, homeschoolers, and they're doing a fundraiser for the home uh, for their group. And so they were looking for vendors, and I was like, sure, why not? Mm -hmm. So it'll probably be a smaller um, venue, but I can still get to meet people and, you know, Absolutely. work out the kinks of how the how a craft sh um, show event should work, so I'm okay. I'm looking forward to that. Almost finished the bottom. The mini wreaths go fairly quickly, and I try to do as much prep work ahead of time so that you don't have to... Uh, worry about that but again I want to thank those that are peeping in from the outside and not stop coming in and say hello but that's okay <laughs> um, thank you for uh, taking a look on my page we are um, kicking off Christmas in July um, I sell my wreaths on Etsy, and they will be uh, hosting. Um, they will be hosting a Christmas in July sale. So I believe it starts next week. I believe so. Um, everything in my shop will be ten percent off. So if you see anything, wait till next week, <laughs> um, and I will make sure I have that. Nina wants to know, oh wait a minute, Donna says he did sacrifice Father's Day weekend, so keep that in mind. Mm. I understand. I understand. <laughs> <laughs> but he loves it just as much as I do. We support each other's correct passions. Because I've spent many a Valentine's Day at a basketball game. Just so you know. There you go. <laughs> <laughs> Just so you know. I was like, it has to be a guy making that schedule. Because a woman would not have made a basketball <laughs> event on Valentine's Day. Right. <laughs> so. And then Nina said, can you make some back to school wreaths? I sure can. I just have to get some more supplies. But I definitely can do that. That's a good suggestion. That is a good suggestion. I probably should have some of those for the July 24th one for all of those homeschoolers. Doggone it. You can whip some small ones oh. together. Oh, yeah, I could do many ones. There you go. Okay. All right, now, Nina, you and your thinking. Now, <laughs> now, I got to work it out. <laughs> Loving basketball. That's correct, Nina. Loving basketball. And lucky for him, I love basketball. <laughs> So, I don't mind the sacrifice. I'm normally their videographer, but they're kicking me to the curb because they got new equipment, so they don't need me anymore. Oh. Except for the away games. And I'm like, I may not travel. That's right. <laughs> Donna says, I had the best school bus week. And I bought those assortments, I mean, those um, accessories, Donna, um, at the... Uh, Oktoberfest in Thermont. That was the first time I had gone. And that's I picked up a lot of uh, ornaments for wreaths at that event. All right. So I crisscrossed the top of that just to make it a little bit fuller. 
Oops. I'm loving it. Which I'll, one did, which part of the ribbon, which, oops. you got two ribbon, two styles of ribbon. Mm -hmm. Did Trent pick both of them out or just one? Um, I think I pulled out this one, that one. and okay. he said match it with this one. He did. I gave him two options okay. and he picked, I can't remember what the other one was. I think he did good. Yeah. I like it. They look good together. Because I've told him, I normally, I want a smaller reef. I normally wouldn't put two, two and a half because they're so big. I normally mm -hmm. would do a one and a half inch, but I think it turned out okay. It's working. Yeah. It looks really good. Again, I'm just twisting it a little bit and then cutting off the excess so that have a finished look. And then I'm going to crisscross it. Oops, wrong crisscross. <laughs> I was telling Susan that, you know, doing these lives and pushing buttons, I was like, I can't wait to be able to get me a Mevo so that you don't see my face the very like up close and personal when you first come <laughs> onto the lives. I think it, it would have been really cute with your hat on. <laughs> <laughs> Someone might get scared away, so I don't want that. No. <laughs> All right, this is the last one. And I just, I folded it in half and then I just pitched it like a little birdie. And I'm putting it in. This ribbon is nice too. It, it's holding a shape really nicely. It is. All right. Very nice. So there is this one. We're almost finished. So to attach the back, I just use pipe cleaner and a trick that one of my cubbies suggested. She puts the glue down first, then she puts the pipe cleaner, staples that, and then puts the glue on top. That is thorough. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so I'm just going to find the And then center. she leaves the hook on the back in case you want to use that separately. That's correct. <laughs> All right, let's see if I can get... Although those two were meant to be, so I can't... Yes. <laughs> Wrapping it around the frame. And I'm trying to get the ribbon so that the tails don't look straight. It does. I will tighten it up. you Nina all right I'm just gonna go through and just make sure my tails look presentable but again I don't want to mess up I'm trying to do my best to cover where I um, clip the pipe cleaner so that you don't see that. You may not notice it, but 
I notice it. So just making sure. But I think I am done. And the fun thing about these minis is you, uh, there's so many different places you could put it. It doesn't have to be on it. It could be on a door, mm -hmm. but it doesn't have to be on a door. Perfect for a kid's room. If they want to decorate something and not take up too much room. If you don't have a office and you just have a cubby, you can hang that on the outside. Or your pet's cubby. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> they don't tear it up. <laughs> or and, or um, windows. Your windows. Great gift for a friend, if not for yourself. Yes, <laughs> yes, true. I That's agree. That's always true. <laughs> So here we go, oh, we have Joy, it. and we have Noel. Two and I get two tiny homes, one of his and hers. <laughs> I'll tell them we need three, one for me, you, and one for Will. There you go. <laughs> oh, those look great. Love them. So ladies, I would like to thank you, or any gents that are out there, I just don't see you. <laughs> um, thank you so much for hanging out. That was pretty quick. How, what time is yeah, it? it's like, uh, 27. All right. Okay. I'm going to keep you for three more minutes. How about that? <laughs> you can sing Christmas Carol. <laughs> okay. <laughs> <laughs> Both are beautiful. Would go great on the outside. Chili door. Hint, hint. Okay. <laughs> right. <laughs> mm -hmm. So here we have it. This is what we made tonight. Well, I made this over the weekend, but we made this one tonight. So. Joy. Or even a lot of people decorate their bookcases now. So you could, they'll, they'll have, sometimes they'll do a framed picture, but you could also All right. have it hanging over yes. a piece or like of furniture or something. Or even you know, in your like, kitchen, you sure. know? Sure, yeah. Because during the holiday, because we seem to commingle um, Halloween and Thanksgiving, so we have a couple of doors that are close to one another, so I might have Halloween on one, <laughs> you know, put one, put the Thanksgiving one on the pantry one, so yes. I'm getting them all in at the that's, same time. That's right. So. All right, you guys, you have a great night, and I will see you next week at 7. Again, we're not going to be in um, my, uh, on my group page. I'm going to continue for the month of July, do them on my business page, so hopefully you can see um, see you next week and invite a friend. You guys have a great night and be safe.